Hi everyone, and welcome to Stephanie Reacts to Once Upon a Time in Wonderland. See, yes, probably thought I forgot it was in Wonderland and not in Storybrooke. Aha! Well, this is Season 1, Episode 7 Bad Blood. Ooh. Could the bad blood be between Alice's father and Alice? Cause we saw Jafar go for go for Alice's father. So maybe if she takes him to Wonderland, you can force Alice to make the wishes. And that's how maybe the bad blood is. Or maybe bad blood between the Queen and the Knave. Cause they two were a thing one day, so before she became Queen. So maybe the bad blood's between them or bad blood between Jafar and the Queen. Hmm, if there's no any of them, I'm stumped. It's been a hot second since I've watched this, but like, two or three weeks? No, it has, because I've had like, recordings done, and I've got, I've not even posted episode five or six yet, I just up uploaded episode four last week, episode five comes up Tuesday. Well, Tuesday coming for me, what will be the third, I think? Yes, the third, the fifth episode must be up. No, 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 the, the fifth episode will be up on the third. That's what it is. So, yeah, I'm just getting more episodes done than now. Because this is a real hot setting, so, yeah. Let's jump into this and see what the bad blood's all about. Starting now. Now right, here we go. And I've got a cup of tea. And this time I'll try not to spill it. Like I did with Cora. Watching that. And somehow the cup just fell out my hand and it spilled everywhere. <laughs> yeah. Here it's here, go. Agrippa, many years ago. Ooh, Aladdin. Was this Jafar again? We will turn him away. He's got Jasmine, or should have Jasmine. That's our deed. That's our spirit flying out. Well, it's good that I'm going now. Bethlehem. But Cyrus maybe not. Cyrus making the chip noise to get your attention. Doubt it though. Dragons don't chirp. They roar. Oh, you got me a flying something. Oh, he's good. He's good. Turn him. He's father, maybe. Turn him. He's his father. I think it's obvious that we don't have time for him to win by Carlos's will. So I'm going to have to steal it. Not on your van. Thank you. Guards, find a cage for him. Ah. Uh, Sorry to hear that. Yeah, off we signed for stealing. <laughs> you know what you were doing when you stole from my guards, didn't you? I thought if you knew who I was, that would take you in. My mother said. I have a son, my heir. 
смерти. А, субеш, Джазмин Нейм. People have to fear you. That's why he's doing now. He's making people fear him, Jafar. He's learning. Oh, Jafar. Block it. Don't let him hit you. That's too big to my knife. No. Sometimes these things just take time. In my experience, when a father has treated a child poorly, it takes a great deal more than time. Look on now. Alice doesn't give up on people. Or even if they deserve it. Like yourself. If you see someone hurting, she can't help but get rid of that pain. It's in her nature. I guess it is. Tag him. Let's go for help him. Maybe. Dragon. In the sky, coming towards us. It looks like some. What the bloody hell is that? The nearest Hungarian. Heh. <laughs> Dragon. God, I forget his name. Dragon. But... Aye. Heh. <laughs> Attack, Jafar. Tomatoes. Please tell me what you know. What has 
Hor veshis. No. Yay! <laughs> You're caught, Jaffa. Was he conjuring now? Boy staff. He doesn't believe again. Or does he? Look at his arm, maybe. He's a needle buzz. Now, we gotta find out who he is. Is this the Sultan's son? He kept slapping him. The sun. I've waited a long time to see you. That isn't it. I know who you are. Look at my face. That is. Called it. The Sultan's son. Well, just you won't know. Mm-hmm. And here it's yet. Why don't you just kill me, Jaffa? You know that I'm never going to give you what you want. Once I get Alice's third wish, I'll be able to change the laws of magic. Which means you won't have to get me what I want. I'll just I can make it. Aye. You can't force somebody to love you, because that's how he's going to change the laws of magic, maybe. He's going to jump, isn't he? He's in life. Use his staff to bring him up a bit. Ah, I thought you would do that. Gonna wake up now, ain't he? He's out and staring at him for no reason, so means he's gonna wake up. Yeah. So then you can wake up even if focus on him. Well, everyone, that was bad blood. Oh, don't know how can it be bad blood. Not unless because he's with the needle thing getting blood out him, and Jafar putting it in a potion. Unless that was bad blood.
But there wasn't any rival between Alf and her father. That was a good thing. They settled their differences at the end there. So... Uh, now can they knew if her father didn't cooperate, comp comp get the word in the new. <laughs> he would either have to take her face, not take his face, or threaten him. And he'd done both. First, he took his face to make him disguise look like him. But, Natala says, how did he find this? See? Was he just wandering about? You saw a beach? Oh, there's a beach, I'll just go there. No. See? Uh, and Alice didn't believe him the first time he arrived. Or maybe she did, but then she wasn't going to forgive him until Jafar conjured a dragon. Then, as soon as the dragon started to attack, she thought it was her father then, and she forgave him then. That was the wrong thing to do. Uh, right away it was. Mm. And I actually thought, when you let Rabbit go, Rabbit would go fetch Alice and tell her, Jafar's got your father. That didn't happen. So I'm guessing the rabbit, the white rabbit's in trouble. Because Alice will ask him, how did Jafar get to England? Then back to here, to a portal. The rabbit. So, yeah, I think the rabbit may be in hot soup soon. Rabbit stew. Uh, if Alice gets to him. I don't know about you, but I would see the rabbit as evil. He's working for the Queen. I know he was, he was a prisoner to Jafar, but he was still helping Jafar he was with portals. Even though Jafar caught the rabbit's foot off a couple of episodes ago. Put it back, so aye. Ew. And I called it about the guy in the cage being assaulting. But this episode kind of kicked it for me a wee bit. We saw his father. We saw Jafar's father. And he was like a young guy. And I don't know, can it be him then? Doesn't even look like him at Disney. Then maybe I clicked. Jafar's a wee boy. And Sultan's got a wee boy. Instead of a wee lassie. With Jasmine. He's got a wee boy instead. But then I clicked. <gasps> maybe the wee boy's in the cage. Maybe that's him grown up. Because they're, they're both about the same age. Now, both adults, they're, they're kind of the same age, but the other ones are a bit older. That's what I thought. Then it was maybe we find out when Jafar was older. Yeah, back to uh, the Sultan. And it was that guy. I don't. I was like the first time. So I did call it ages ago, my first saw him. Then so that's, we first saw the guy in the cage then, is that the Sultan maybe? <laughs> so, yeah, you've got one for me. So, I, I would call it maybe a point, or half a point. Because I thought it was the Sultan. But then I thought it was the Sultan's son, yeah, in this episode. Mm. But Jafar only wants one thing. I love you. Why can't you get that somewhere else then? Why does it have to be from his father? Why does it have to be from the Sultan? Because all he wants is to wishes to make somebody love you. That's just stupid. It is. First, he says, I know he's going to try to change the laws of magic, but first, you can't force somebody to love you with a wish. So he's got to try to change that, the laws of magic, to make him say that. But secondly, hmm. As his father says to him, if you have to force her on someday, then there's no true love. It wouldn't be if you have to steal it from you. <coughs> mm. But I thought Sultan done the right thing. He jumped. I know it's a bad thing, killed suicide. Is, but no one more way to get escaped Jafar. But then Jafar using his magic to bring the carpet. Just Oh, sorry about that, it's a bit cold in here, so I'll be yawning a wee bit. Because it's cold. Because I was watching that, I was concentrating on the episode. I wasn't getting cold. <laughs> no, it's finished. I'm getting all like, shivery, I've been my arms. Am I? So, 
so I. <laughs> but I guess it says it's a good episode it was. We got more of your flashback story. The thing that confuses me. His mother died. And you like a smoky thing. Is that like her spirit leaving? But then as soon as the blanket fell off Jafar's face when he was a wee boy after he after the sultan drowned him. You saw that wee smoke coming back. Was that Jafar's life or Jafar's spirit? Or was that his mother's mother's spirit like forcing him to be alive? Hmm. That's what confuses me a wee bit to so the smoke thing. Is that his? Is that his mother's? Hmm. Huh. Now I still don't know what that is, so... That's what he says. Manga kept me alive. So, now I didn't like it how the salt and salmon kept in. <laughs> Jafar kept slapping him over the face. But at least Jafar learned a lot then. So he says, you have to make people scared of you to have power. So... He had to make the Sultan and his son scared and stuff. That's what he had. That's what he did. Uh, but when Alice had to wish her father back, yowch. Wish number two. I forget what wish number one was. I forget that. But wish number two. Wait. Forget what I was going I thought I remembered what wish number one was there. You're probably thinking what I'm thinking is turning, turning Will back from a statue. Isn't it that? The Queen turned Will back with the dust. So I've seen, seen that bit, but. Try to think what the second, the first wish was. Try to think, yeah. I'll probably come in, I'll probably do. Oh, that's it! But anyway, I'll continue what I'm saying. So, as soon as his father gave Alice hope, he done. Cyrus is free, he's roaming the land somewhere, looking for you. So, they climbed all that mountain for no reason, go up and flew up to it, somehow. You never seen them flying up, so. Did they make the basket, or, or the twigs, or whatever it was? And as soon as he got up, his father fell. Instead of letting them die, she wished them at home. But it always comes to the price magic does. That's what Cyrus says, no Cyrus. That's what Will says to her. So, hmm. What was this one be? Maybe his father, her father, will break up with his fiance slash new wife. Maybe them. Or well, maybe he'll start having nightmares and stuff about Alice. Because he knows it's real, but he doesn't mind going to an asylum place like Alice was. So he'll probably pretend it's all fake. Maybe that'll be the course. Of it. I mean, it won't be a course. But you know what I'm talking about. That'll be the payment. Hmm. And soon, if you zoomed on Cyrus, I don't. He's going to be awake now, isn't he? See? The next episode. Home. Now I was just talking about home there, like, I wished her father to be home. So, maybe we're getting a wee bit, a wee tiny bit of backstory of Alice, maybe, when she's home. Or maybe Alice somehow pops home. To see her father and ask where her father is, then check, check. Checking on her father. Or could it be home? Cyrus gets finds his lamp and gets back into his bottle. Maybe that's home. Or maybe I doubt we'll see more about Jafar's backstory to that. It's gonna be like at home. I'm guessing it's all a bit bit that 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 I'm guessing there'll be more about Alice's father, maybe. I don't know. Till that next week. So yeah everyone, so until then, have a good day, good night, good week, good weekend. Stay safe out there. I know a lot of parts of the world, I think, Engl I'm not in England, I'm not. I'm in the further end of it, not up in Scotland, but we England, they're going into lockdown too. 
I saying lockdown because I know this virus is getting worse for all you out there so stay safe look after yourselves everyone and I'll see you then the next one bye everyone